Yo, what's up? It's Ezra here from EzraSlayton.com, and today we are going to be doing a little bit of income, and also I'm going to walk you through how I'm able to put together a blog post and get it up there published and, you know, on Pinterest in like 30 minutes or less. Uh, this is a great way for me to save time. I'm pretty busy right now, and hey, let's just get into it. All right, so uh, this is my bank account for Chase. I'm not going to scroll up and show too much here. Uh, about my information, but this is for uh, you know all of my my website stuff to try to. What I want to say is like, if you guys start an online business, uh, if you can set up a separate account for it, so that when it's time to do your taxes, you don't screw yourself over because you know when you go in there, you you have like write-offs and things like that. But anyway, this month it's been going pretty good. We got seventy, one hundred one, twenty-three, or actually last month. 23, 122, 110 right there. The balance is like 1,004. Uh, so that's that's my Chase account. That's for uh, my website, EzraSlayton.com. Started from zero, now it's up there. So it's growing, it's growing steadily, and things are starting to pick up. My email, uh, my email account, I've got 1,900. This one's been growing pretty rapidly too. It was like at least 40 subscribers every single day. So in no time, I'm sure by the end of this year, we'll be doing pretty good. Let me just quickly do the math. If I got 40, let's do 40 times, let's do 90. So if that keeps up for 90 days, we'll be at 3,600 in about three weeks. We'll be, you know, we'll add three, three, six plus. So plus one, nine, one, five. We'll be at, we'll be over 5,000 and that's pretty, actually that's expensive for um, Aweber. So that's going to cut into my account also. So anyway, uh, this is Survey Junkie. What we've made here today, $6, $7.50 yesterday. And I, yesterday I also made $25 in um, commissions from the, what's it called? Funnel X ROI. And probably I got some sales on Get Response as well. Probably added a new, uh, a new subscriber there as well. So we'll just take a quick look and we'll see what's going on in there. Let me log in. And ClickBank, I checked. There's like two new trials. People doing a trial offer on ClickBank. So in a few days, they might convert over. This one's at 37. Let's do referred accounts. Eight total uh, new sales. This is for August. If I can go back to the previous month. Um, so... Get response free. This one was created on the 31st. Monthly. This one's paid, paid. Okay. So total sales, we've got eight people there. Uh, I can do earnings and payout. Maybe that'll show. Last payout was 75. Pending 37. So that's that. And those are the recurring ones, which we really want to do. So that's pretty much the income. If you guys haven't seen my income reports in the past, you can check those out to learn how I'm able to get this income. But now I want to show you guys how I'm able to put together a blog post pretty quickly. I could do as many as I want a day, really. I could probably do, with my current schedule and what's going on in my life right now, I'd probably pump out like 10 blog posts a day if I wanted to, if they were all you know fitting this exact strategy that i'm doing like if you look at my latest posts uh, 41 best ways 37 simple ways 30 popular ways 27 ways 33 ways i'm just hitting different ways to earn money or different ways to make money online and then i'm doing the long tail uh, keywords like this one ways to earn money as a teenager or broke teenager this one's ways to earn money in college this one 30 ways uh it's just, it's just basically 30 ways 30 popular ways <laughs> didn't really hit a keyword on that one uh ways to make money and pay off debt okay and this one is uh make money online starting right now okay so uh let's just show you how i do that let me go to my dashboard really quick i'll show you my workflow how i go through the process and uh, hopefully you guys can you know model what i'm doing and maybe get some results going in for your online business uh, but the tip for today is make sure you set up a separate bank account for your online expenses or everything you're doing in your online business 
So when it comes time to do taxes on that business, you're gonna be you're gonna be okay when you take it to the to the CPA guy or whatever. So don't mix it up with your business or your don't mix your business and your personal stuff. All right, you're gonna you're just gonna screw yourself up if you're just getting started. That's your tip for the day. So let's get into the workflow. I'll go to new posts and I'll just open that straight away. Let me go over to Pinterest. Well, let me just go to Google and get some ideas from Google. Ways to earn money. So right now we're doing a little keyword research and figuring out which long tail keyword I could rank for. There's tons of different ways that you can go about doing this, but I like to use either Pinterest. I'll go on Pinterest and let them do their autofill like this one. It says creative ways to make money, make money fast today, real ways to make money from home. Um, I might hit real ways to make money from home for this one. How to make quick money in one day, how to make money online for free. That That's a, I don't know, maybe we could do that one. But anyway, ideas to make money, how to make money online for free. If you have this plugin right here, it's called Keywords Everywhere, you'll have this little uh, list on the side right here also that you can you can check out the volume uh, and the competition okay how to make money for kids how to make money as a teenager I just did that one creative ways to make money uh, real ways to make money from home with real ways to make money from home let's see who is doing this one this one's got seven thirteen 50 legitimate ways to make money from home but they don't have it in the title this one has real ways to make money from home in the title make money from home real ways to make money from home real ways to make money without leaving your home okay all right we'll go with that 11 real ways to make money from home we're going to do real real ways to make money from home all right so that's our keyword for today we got that so let's just do let's pick a random number between 11 and 40 let's do 30 39 39 real ways to make money from home and let me see if i can add anything else in there So maybe I can rank for something similar. Uh, let's just do like starting now. I like this starting now. Starting now. Okay, once I've got that, I've got my title. Uh, I'm gonna go over to Canva and I'm just gonna create my images really quick. I need two images to start out. I want my blog image, the banner, blog banner image. The header image, I guess, and then um, also a Pinterest image. Okay, I need those two things to get started. And hopefully this won't take forever because it's loading so slow. Come on, Canva. Load up for me. All right. All right, so let's do blog banner first. And then I'll just resize it afterwards. I'm going to make it very simple just for today's example and I can go back later after the video is done and and change things around <clears throat> so let's do real ways to make real ways to make money from home let me just copy that come over to the design and we'll do make money from I assume, make money at home and get rid of that paste that real ways to make money from home that's fine and let me download that actually I need to change the file real ways to make money at home saving changes I'll change to save let's click download I like to download as JPEG smaller image size helps your page to load faster and faster load times are better for your SEO rankings. If your page takes too long to load, people will click off. Your bounce rate increases. Google doesn't like that. And you get slapped. So let me save that really quick. 
close this down. Let me go to resize just to save time today. Usually I would create a, a totally different one, but I don't want to spend too much time. I'm just kind of take you guys through the workflow of how I create my blog posts rather quickly. It doesn't have to take a ton of time. And where is it? Okay, it's already here. It's just feeling the whole thing. All right, make money from home. It's too, this is kind of small, make money at home, but I, it's fine for today. I'll just, I'll just throw some quick little elements on the top and the bottom here to fill up that, that space. Uh, let me go to recently used. Uh, I'll just grab a fat arrow. Throw that right there. And one more down at the bottom. See. When did I use these? Okay, okay, okay. Let's do this dollar sign. Throw that down there. Try and center it up a bit. All right, super basic. And one more thing. Let me grab a text. And I'll do my little watermark. Ezra Slayton dot com. Because eventually someone's going to try and swipe my pen and use it as their own. Make money at home. And for the pens, I'd recommend you do it a little bit different from this one. Like I would really blow up the text. Uh, I like the black and white. I think that's working out really well for me. I, I find those pens do pretty good. If you want to do like images on the back of your pen, that's fine too. Uh, but I'm seeing more success with... Um, with just you know the most basic pins are doing really well the ones I put a ton of effort and work into and try to design them to look all crazy good actually don't end up performing too well so nowadays I just keep it really simple alright so I've got my two images now let me close this and I'll come back to the post and I'll press on here so I got my title, I got my images. I'll roll down this right side and we'll do the categories, make more money. I'll add a few tags. Let's do uh, real ways to make money as one. Uh, make money from home and that's good enough. Next thing I'll do, I'll put my image in. Let me go upload, select image. Turn that light back on. Uh, pictures. EzraSlayton.com. Real, 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 real. Where is it? There you go. Real ways. A little SEO tip for you guys who might be beginners. You want to put something in your alt text here. So we're trying to rank for that real ways to make money online or make money from home. So we're going to put it in the alt text. So when Google crawls your site, they look at that alt text and it helps them to decide what your what your uh, post is about. The expert excerpt. I'll just put real ways to make money from home starting now. Um, you tired of working uh, nine to five? Discover how to fire your boss in with these make money online methods all right just super simple for today's method I might go back in here later and change some of this stuff out uh, but obviously we just want to save you guys some time just show you my basic rundown let's go real ways to make money from Are you are you tired of seeing a bunch of crap ways to make money from home that you know don't work? Uh, this list is the solution to your problems. 
to that problem, to your problem. Start making money. Okay, you see that? Start making money. Start making money. All right. This plugin is called Yoast SEO plugin. Help you with your SEO rankings. Highly recommend it if you are a beginner. Okay, and just one more thing, and then we'll be pretty much done with this blog post. Let's upload the pin in image. And I forgot what we saved that as real ways. Let's go down to the R real ways. All right, once that's loaded up, we'll drop the alt text in there, and we'll, we'll be good to go. Good to go. There we go. Select that. Um, for the Pinterest description, uh, let me go over to Pinterest really quickly and find a good one. I'll click on search right here. We'll type in the, the keyword we're trying to rank for, which was real ways to make money from home. And we'll see what people are doing. Maybe we'll see what people are doing if this thing will load. Quick question for you guys. Did you watch the Democratic debates? Uh, I think it was going to be last night. I don't know. I'm in China, so I, was, I, was, I watched it yesterday. Um, I was a big fan. I am a big fan of Andrew Yang, so I was really paying attention to what he had to say and his closing statement really was pretty good if you guys haven't seen that check it out Andrew Yang he's gonna get he's running on this campaign of giving everyone a thousand dollars a month which is gonna be a game changer for anyone trying to start an online business because all your tools are pretty much paid for your website is paid for you don't have to worry about that uh, traffic you can buy you don't have to worry about that and so on and so forth so let's see how to make money and get paid on pinches real ways to make extra money all right this person is the only one who's got it on their pin and in their title I mean, last quarter of the year how are you been making money on how to make extra money it's just really simple this one right here it doesn't got too many repins though just two so maybe people aren't searching for that really on pinterest so we'll just keep it basic real ways to make money from home and then we'll do make money hashtag uh, work from home and save the draft this plugin that I'm using for for doing my pins is called social warfare social warfare custom options so the plugins I use for my website I use uh, the Google Analytics, obviously, Social Warfare, and I like to use Thrive. I've got Simple Pay for my Stripe connection, and then Pretty Links uh, for link shortening and, and making links look pretty, I guess. So those are my plugins. All right, that's good. We'll click Save Draft. <laughs> a little distracted right there. This is my workflow. This is what I do to make the make the blog posts that earn some some dollars online all right what I did I just click on launch thrive architect and it will open up the the page builder to help me create these blog posts very quickly initially you got to put in the work to create the templates but then after that you just drag and drop the templates into the blog post and you're done it is duplicate content if you don't go in there and change a word here and there it, it, it's definitely going to be duplicate content but I've heard that Google does not care about duplicate content if it's on your own website oh that's new oh that's cool I'm going to see what this logo thing is about your logo okay so that's a new feature they just brought in interesting it's not very useful for me but I'm sure other people will find it so my first template is my how to get paid box which links people over to the uh, survey offer so they sign up for a survey junkie and survey junkie pays me a dollar fifty for every lead that I generate for them 
Next one, I'll throw my disclaimer in there. This is just letting people know that there are affiliate links, and if they click on them, I will earn a commission. And the final thing is my ways to earn. And that is basically it. That is over 40 ways to earn money. And these are real ways to make money from home. Okay, and then I can add more later if I want to. But that is it. I'll throw another text at the bottom just for fun. Let's see, leave a comment below if you know of more real ways to of more real ways to make money from home and I'll bold this one bold that one okay and that's pretty much it I'll do a save and exit and I'll publish this bad boy once that's done, I'll change the save, publish, publish. All right. Let me hit a refresh here and see if it's ready to go. Okay, now the blog post is ready to roll. That's it. That's all you got to do. Once you've set up these things, it's just drag and drop. You can do, like today I just did, this is my third blog post today. Um, after I post it, I'll go to share it on Facebook, and I'll share it on um, all the social medias that I have connected to here. LinkedIn I have, I think. I don't know. And I'll just keep it simple today. Sometimes I'll I'll go in here and you know write a bit more for the you know for right there, but when I want to say something about it. It's totally up to you. Whatever you want to do, you do. But this is my workflow. You can copy it, model it, whatever you want. It's fine. Next is Pinterest. And I'll talk a little bit more about uh, the, the additional things I do for Pinterest. So Let's do... When you post to Pinterest, make sure the first time you post the pin you post it to a board that gets a lot of reshares and the way you can you know the way you can know whether or not a pin is or a board is getting a lot of reshares is to use an app called Tailwind Tailwind will help you to figure that stuff out okay so after i shared it over to Pinterest i like to come in here go to my profile find that new pin click on pins Well, shout out to my internet. It's moving a bit faster than it was earlier today. And as I say that, it slows down. You jinxed it. Okay, so now we've just hit a snag. I thought Adblock was able to run on this site. Okay. All right. Sorry for the delay here, but uh, for some reason, don't run on pages on this site. Okay. Don't do that. For some reason, it's not working right now. I wanted to show you guys what I do after I pin to Pinterest, but it's not working. So I'll just tell you. So hopefully you can get it just from from my words. Go to profile. Um, after I pin to Pinterest, I'll use this little Chrome extension called Tailwind Publisher. Tailwind helps me to schedule out all my pins really rapidly. Um, I'll find that pin, and I'll you know I'll schedule it to all of the relevant boards over the next. Like it'll pin it to every board, every, every, well, however long you set it. It could be like every 10 minutes or it could be every 10 days. It's just up to you. But I generally do like every six hours, it'll pin to each board. 
Dun, dun, dun. Let's see if it'll work for us. Bam. Go to pins. All right, here we go. Um, sometimes I'll promote it too to give it a little bit of juice just to get it going. But I click on it here and then I click on the extension and it'll be right here. It says schedule. And I just schedule it out and that's pretty much it. I will go back. I'll make like five pins for that one blog post and I'll do the same thing with the scheduling. I'll pin it to the... Uh, the board that has the most repins, the most, the highest virility score, and I'll just schedule it out. Let's see. Yeah. Type in the board. Let's see, uh, best. Let's see if this thing's okay. There we go. Got all these boards right here. I've already pinned it to this one, so I'll cut it out. You don't, you don't want to pin to the same. You don't want to pin the same pin to the same board. That's spammy and you will get your account banned for doing that make money online but you can pin to as many boards as you like just, just keep creating boards i will add to tribes usually but this pin i don't think is like that great so i don't do that right for this one click use intervals we're going to set the intervals down to about every seven hours so that'll pin uh two or three times a day I guess optimize it set intervals and schedule now <clears throat> this is how I get traffic to my website tailwind has a free uh, trial where I guess you can I think you can do like a hundred pins a month for free uh, but that's not enough you're gonna need to upgrade uh, to really see results with uh, with that app okay so that's all done I just let me go to tailwind really quick tailwind publisher queue drafts and show you guys a little bit about tailwind um, I've got the plus plan I, I did cancel it because uh, I just want to see how things go after I after it finishes so if things are are going well and I don't need to publish anymore then I'll cancel it and I don't need to pay for it because hey things are going well but anyway you see my schedule right here on the right this is how many pins I'm pinning per day it's quite a bit uh, I'm gonna probably slow it down I thought I had set the schedule to like just 20 or 30 a day it looks like it picks up around this time okay uh, but you drag your pins in here and just upload them and you know it does everything for you pinterest is or not pinterest but well pinterest is amazing but tailwind is really helpful for scheduling those pins so if you want i'll drop a link for the resources i mentioned in today's video in the description of the video um so that was tailwind uh starting your blog you know, I use Thrive Architect to do my blog posts pretty quickly by having their uh, their templates. But if you don't want to pay for a Thrive Architect, because it is it's a little bit expensive for beginners who don't generate any money online yet, then you can use Google Docs. You can create your blog post one time in Google Docs if you do something similar to to what I do. And then you can just copy from Google Docs and paste it into your, your WordPress uh, editor. And that's it. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, you know, leave them down there in the comment section below. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. It's a bit of a long video, so apologize for that. But uh, yeah, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down below. Peace, love, and paychecks. We'll see you guys. On the next video, adios.